so evaluation of foot foot examination general appearance you have to see monofilament test could be done easily monofilament test could be done easily as, as i could uh, show you one of the monofilament uh, just a minute is a mono filament what you need to do you need to take your foot and press it till it tilts so if the patient feels it then it's fine but if it doesn't then he is he should be screened for the neuropathy there are four five points to be uh, checked upon it so the general appearance mono filament ankle jerk vibrations in that we will see peripheral pulses and shape size and color the, all these things comes in a diabetic foot examination that you can see ankle jerk elicitation uh, vibration sense by 128 hertz tuning fork semi winston monofilament as i showed is a simple screening test for diagnosing patients with risk of ulcers due to peripheral sensory neuropathy this is a probe test for osteomyelitis if it is having if there is a gritty feel in the base it suggests that there is uh infection has led to the osteomyelitis investigation all the general investigation you will do for metabolic status in addition to that you will have x-ray biothesiometry pus culture sensitivity peripheral doc because as in my clinic clinical uh, practice as well i treat the diabetic foot on these lines itself so this is actually a uh, break your ankle index what this is an ultrasound guided one this is biothesiometry for neuropathy peripheral neuropathy screening and how much they have sensation preserved or lost so this is diabetic positive myelitis in the left side you could see the hazy shadows where actually there is the infection and this is charcot's foot on the um, constant uh, pay attention to the metatarsal area so classification of diabetic foot as we mentioned neuropathic and neuroischemic so neuropathic would be warm perfused deformities like claws prone to sharp or arthropathy and develop necrosis here it's usually cool or pulseless poor perfusion neuropathy coexist can readily develop necrosis plantar ulcers rare but ulcers develop at the edges of the foot as we see so edges of the foot and on the pressure points is a differentiating factor